Good look at what we can expect the rest of the afternoon. Thanks so much. Good afternoon. We'll stick with partly to mostly cloudy skies, slightly blustery conditions, and spotty showers over the mountains. It's a pretty Friday afternoon in Pueblo from our Viera Wireless Neighborhood Weather Network camera. Nothing in the way of showers so far on live HE Doppler radar. However, I'm starting that moisture, I'm expecting that moisture to begin to develop over the high country first before spreading along the foothills. We'll be tracking all of that very carefully. In a 4 p.m., we'll have the 60s dropping to the 50s primarily by 8 o'clock. So if you're out and about later on tonight, I'd definitely make sure that you have the jacket. Between 2 and 4 p.m., Showers will begin developing over the southwestern corner of the state, and that's really where the brunt of the moisture is going to stay. Even still, I'm expecting some of that moisture to creep north and to the northeast. This will look at 6 o'clock. While Skycast keeps the majority of this water to the west of the I-25 corridor, I'm expecting it to track a bit east, impacting Teller and Fremont counties, so do be prepared for that. Overnight, we'll deal with mostly cloudy skies into early tomorrow morning. We've got the chance for some of those showers to creep north along the I-25 corridor, impacting us both in the morning and into the afternoon. These showers tomorrow look to be very hit or miss. Even still, you'll want access to our Storm Tracker 13 weather app. It is free and available to download to both Apple and Android devices. Tonight, we've got temperatures dropping to the 30s and 40s. Tomorrow's highs a bit cooler for some select neighborhoods. Out east, we'll see the 70s. Your 70 forecast looks like this. We've got a 20% chance for showers on Saturday, but beyond that, we're keeping things dry. Of course, we'll let you know if that changes. We stay in the 60s the rest of the way on out, with overnight lows dipping to the 30s and the 40s. Within Pueblo, 65 tomorrow, a 20% shot at seeing some pockets of rain. 60s, 70s as we carry you all the way through the end of next work week, dealing with dry conditions after Saturday. Within Canyon City, yep, another chance for some scattered showers tomorrow, but we dry things up quickly into Sunday. We stay dry all the way through next Friday with partly to mostly sunny skies. Finally, in Teller County, chances for showers carrying us all the way through the weekend beyond that dry until we hit next Friday. We could see our extended forecast change. Obviously, we have several days to make that happen, and we'll let you know of the latest developments, of course, as we are continuously tweaking your forecast. A look at current temperatures coming up next. In the meantime, just enjoy this fall weekend. Mm -hmm. That's right. Thanks, Abby. Mm -hmm.